And hello, 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 and welcome back to some more Victoria 2 Finish Mega Campaign Fun. And uh, let's get back to it. Now, my current military is going. It's getting better, actually. It's getting quite decent. Um, getting a lot of. Ooh, a bunch of Lithuanians, Ugrians, Finnish. How many Finnish do we have? One, two, three, four, five potential regiments I can build. Well, I might hold off on that for the moment, because I've got to afford all this. For the most part. Oh, now I'm losing money all of a sudden. I was making a whole bunch, now I'm losing a whole bunch. Now I'm making money again. Hmm, interesting. Now, breach load of rifles will not be done until 1866. Though, that does get me colonial negotiations once it, once it is done. So that does have benefits to it. Breach load of rifles. Might make the game go a bit faster at 3 speed, because I want to start colonizing some of these provinces over here. At 25 and whatnot. So once I get them done, I, 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 I then I'm building them, I guess. I am not colonizing all that, actually. Is that its own independent state? No, it's a satellite. And I believe I've got a bunch of bureaucrats going, doing their thing over here as well. You're nearly done. Oh, plur plurality. Okay. Nearly done over here in Maryland. Will I be able to afford it, though, more importantly? Not sure at the moment. My population is gradually going up. Nearly 2%. And they're also doing stuff in Tennessee. Getting plenty of soldiers in Orsha. Getting some into there as well. That's at 100. That's at 100 percent. Oh, we've got an um, anarcho liberals have only got two percent. The upper house. Conservatives are losing a little bit, and the socialists are making gains. At least though, I can turn. Maryland now is one of those provinces. Good. So if Maryland's now completed, what about Washington? That would be really cheap to get done, actually. District of Columbia. The more of these places I get completed, the better. Now, are they trying to build factories over here, actually? In these overseas provinces. Oh, really, uh, can you get these railroads done already, or is it going to take forever? I think it's going to take forever, actually. I'll spot them, money. If you build the winery, I'll spot it. As long as you get it done, this one's done. Yeah, they're actually attempting to build it now. Rio Grande de Norte. Build machine parts factory. Yep, I'm down for that. If it gets built, it gets built. to supplement it so it gets done quicker. Um big game hunting and whatnot, yeah just get it done. Yep, get a railroad in Massachusetts. I'd be pretty happy about that. If I keep spotting all this money they'll get they'll get them done quicker. Need to start getting some factories in North America, because Tataria, Massachusetts. I'm making a fair bit of money still. Does that mean I can afford to build more? Um, I think I can. They're Danish over there, aren't they? Now, oh. well, let's increase the that and build a railroad while you're at it. Build a railroad. Can't build a naval base there. What about Konigsberg on the naval base? Oh, that's already up to max. What about Danzig? We've got a decent amount of coin at the moment, so I can afford to build all these places. Good. 
can probably afford to build another bigger naval base over here as well. We should probably start to build forts, I reckon. So we might start building forts at the border. The more forts, the better, I think. Um, spending a crap ton of money as well. Um, that'll do for the moment. I'll build more soonish, but eight should do for the yeah moment. Yep, that'll be fine. Got a lot of railroads building, like a lot. No, I'm not going to make the Asherons f force them to repay their debt. All these provinces are pretty much connecting up now. Konigsberg needs one. Need to link these provinces up. Okay, I still actually get a few of these built now. Um, no, I can't build them now. Oh, is that because of the marshes over there? Are they called the Tripit Marshes? Is that what they're called? I can't remember. Um, yes, you can have access. Oh, they're kind of trapped at Kiev, aren't they? Russian soldiers. Oh, that's right, we built a whole bunch of soldiers, didn't we? They're all Russians, I think. Is that the Russian army N over there? Nope. Are those the Mongols or are they the Russians? Nope, they're all Russian, I think. If that's the case, send them all over there. No, wait a second, they're Mongols. Are they Mongols as well? They're also Mongols. Are these guys Mongols as well? No, they're Russians. What about Mongols? Mongols, Mongols. Nope. The Mongols, aren't they? They yep, send them over there then. I can't move these those troops at all, can I? Nope. A little bit annoying, but can't do much about it, so I'm not really gonna whinge about it. Back to building, I guess. Can I get an alliance with the United Kingdom yet? I really want an alliance with Oh wait a second, they're at war with Andalusia. Andalusia tried to get me to join the war, but I wasn't able to click it in time. Combine that into that army. Send them over there. Now, how many more troops can I build over here? A bit a lot. Well, a lot of people want to join the army now because it's a lot more profitable than what it was. To put it simply. Yeah, build all that. I need it. I need it. It's going in the negative for a few, for, for, for a few brief seconds. Um, bureaucrats nearly done and finished Tennessee as well. How are they going in District of Columbia? Well, they're getting slightly better. What, what about the Miami? Are they... No, they haven't tried to yet. Finish Ontario. Where's the Colonial Map Mode? Colonial Map Mode. Colonial Map Mode. There it is. So all these provinces no longer colonies, is that what you're trying to tell me? Or is it just the border provinces? I'm not entirely sure how that works. Oh, they're getting tobacco. Tobacco is pretty sweet. Get all the tobacco! This 
30 regions that army, but I'm going to increase the size of it. 916, 1,554, 1,030, 2,300, 1,200, 210, 215, 1, 7, 1, 6, 1, 67. So there's decent amounts of reserves. Good luck for it, actually. Well, they're predominantly Finns in Konigsberg now. That's interesting. Don't know how that happened. Anyway, send them to um, Ostprussian. What about Danzig? Nope, they're not too keen on it. Latvia. Let's send them to Latvia, I reckon. Latvia. Latvia. Now, um, population. Let's go to Latvia. Let's find it on the map. Show them to Karelia instead. How many soldiers in Karelia? There's potential there. Maybe we should send them to Karelia instead. Hmm. Seriously, where's Latvia? I have no idea. If I go and pass it, I probably have, haven't I? Without realizing. Oh, I've gone past it because I'm an idiot. Um, there is a few fins there, to be fair, so we probably should try to work it to some extent. Two, six, ooh. Encourage bureaucrats. And why are they still doing their job in Tennessee? Ugh. Wasn't watching that properly, I think. What about Louisiana? More of these provinces that are completed with all that stuff, the better. Ah, a few of those regiments have been built. Awesome source. If that is the case... Those Finns over here in Dorpat Infantry, no, they're Estonians. Well, there's been another election. The Conservatives are slowly losing a bit of power here and there. The reactionaries don't as much. The Socialists are gradually making gains. Um, I'm not sure then if that's the case. Wait a second, is that all the regiments? I honestly can't remember. Okay, that'll be done in June. I'm gonna speed it up a bit actually. It's going a little slow. Because I want to get colonial negotiations done, because once that's done, I don't have to deal with it for a while. They're encouraging soldiers over there, but I wonder how many they're actually going to be able to get. Okay, it seems to have increased a bit. Um, what was the other place I'd sent them? I'd sent them to... Latvia, and also... to uh, Ostprussian. Where is Ostprussian? Ostprussian, Ostprussian... Ah, here it is. They're trying to encourage him. But they're not keen at all on joining the army. Hmm, we wonder. Finnish Tennessee. Up there, Nyensk. Sorry, that's not how you pronounce that at all. Should I send the Finnish Samara? What about Ingria, actually? Yeah, I'm gonna send uh, Which one's Ingria? Is Ingria over here? Um, or do I attempt to send them back over here to do Karelia again? I think the last time they tried to get troops in Karelia, it kind of was a bit of a failure. Yeah, why not? Let's just do it. Um, encourage soldiers away from... West Prussia and... Where 
Where should, else should I send them? Where else should I send them? Bransk! Found the Bransk area. Actually, that's something to Smolensk, I think. It is nice of Finns there. Yeah, I got something to Smolensk, I think. Turn 50. Let's go back to population. Um, Smolensk, Smolensk, Smolensk. Smolensk, where is Smolensk? Not many Finns there, but I believe I can build that up a bit. And the other place I sent them to was... Karelia. They should all want to join them, Karelia. Look, these man's have fins there, there's potential for Karelia. Um, also... We look here, where, what are they trying to invest in? Oh, see, it's built the bloody railroad already. Grr. Come here and get done. Tataria needs one as well. Political reform desire has been completed. Steel factory, that just seems like a logical thing to get, so I'm going to encourage the building of that, most definitely. Tataria, just get Tataria done. It's taking forever to get Tataria done. Um, who wants access? Yep, Ming Dynasty, you can have access. It's alright. Small arms factory in Tataria. Yep, just keep building those factories. I'm making a lot of money now. Just know the border areas, I think, is probably a good spot to put all the fortresses. Just to kind of deter them from potentially trying to make an attack. Though they probably will, it won't really matter. Um, fortify Kiev. This place. And this place. And that place. That'll do for the moment, because I've spent a lot. We need to upgrade our railroads as well. They're not really up to current stands. There's a lot more railroads floating around now, at least. That's something. They pretty much crisscrossed the land. Is there no railroad in Piskov? I suppose there is. Okay, that's alright then. About this province here. Oh, it's got one. Okay, fair enough. Any railroads over here at all? Not really. They're trying to build some, but it's going to take a while. Well, I've dropped down to seven. Not a great power anymore. Well, sorry, I'm still a great power. Take that back. I'm done pretty soonish. 1866. Bit a year away. Yay! They lost militancy. Not being dicks anymore. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Why on earth is that the case? Send them to, send them to Quebec City. I wouldn't mind building up my fleet a bit actually. Because it is a bit lacking. Check out my education, my admin points up a bit. Could probably afford to bring down tariffs as well. So I'm going to do that. And minimum wage. If you can decrease everything, you might as well make your people happy. Don't, don't, don't piss them off unnecessarily. You still make money. The plight of 1865 
Well, no, we're going to be helping them out. We're not going to um, let them go to the wolves necessarily. Uh, I'm involved in a war, and am I the head of it? I really hope I'm not, and I probably will be. And I'm the head of the war. Ah, uh, bugger. So now I'm helping out them. We're also fighting the United Kingdom and Middle Frank here. Suomi, Pinsk, Bavaria. Now, what allies of mine can I call in, more importantly? Ooh, and are these guys starting to colonize those areas? Or do they always have that? I can't remember. Um, that's really annoying. I didn't want to be involved in that war at all. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to call in Andalusia, see if they're keen to join in. Hopefully they'll take control of it. Call in our partner to aid us. How, they have a truce to the United Kingdom. That's annoying. Now, what allies do I have so I can call them in? Then, if that's the case, it's got um, Colombia, Italy, and Lucia. Not good. Yep, they'll come to the war. The problem is fund both Middle Francia and the United Kingdom. And I don't have that many troops over here that I can send against them. And look at British Peru. They're going to stomp me. They're not going to be able to do much. I basically have next to no troops over there. So I'm going to bring these guys back over here. That's pretty annoying. Um, if I get an alliance with France, that'd be pretty sweet. I'll take that. No, increase relations then if that's the case. What's the chance of getting an alliance with these guys? I'm trying to get an alliance with them for a while, but they won't accept either. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to go, if that's the case. Ming Dynasty, it looks like it's going to hurt people as well. Hmm, <laughs> because we're going to fight the Middle Franks now. This is going to be difficult. British Liberation against the United King. King, we're not surprised to learn that Colombia is joining. Of course Colombia was going to join, they always were going to join in. Look how many troops they've got over there. I've got next to none I can fight them with. You send them north. Might as well. Um, I don't know how many troops they've got over here in British North America. Much more than me, I've now discovered. Can I afford to mobilize all the troops? Not sure I can, but I'll give it a crack regardless. They've probably got better infantry than me as well. certainly have more troops. Mm, I really did not want to be involved in this at all. So who else are we fighting again? We're also fighting the Asherons. Someone who I don't really want to be fighting. Might as well just go occupy that territory and knock them out of the war. Because they won't join the war, will they? They won't. They're going to be. They're going to be annoying like that. You losing troops? Can't you have that many there? That's a bit, bit piss poor. Um, can I actually decrease that? Then, oh wait a second. They are. Do we have? No, we don't. Okay. Problem is, I can't call in the towns for oh, sorry, Andalus Serum for a couple of years. Once I can call them in, though, make things a fair bit easier. They're still making money, surprisingly. Well, it shouldn't be so surprising, actually. Finish New York. How expensive is that? 16. Well, we're going to encourage bureaucrats there regardless. As soon as I have to say, I think I might just have to say no to some of these wars, I'll tell you. I've not got the Asherons, at least I can contribute to something.
Yep, send them all over there. Wow, they're losing heaps. I'm going to have to decrease the size of this army, I think, because it's just too big. Copping way too much attrition. I'm sending them south then, I guess. They start to occupy my territory? They are. They just got a lot more troops. I just can't really do anything against that many. Keep sending them south. They only occupied that province, have they? It's because they got artillery. I think it might be in part. They still copying attrition. How are they still copying attrition? I send them down to Orsha then. I don't know how they're copying attrition still. It's quite annoying when that happens. Because they, 39, they had about 44, it was about 44 regiments, it was about 40, I think it might have been about 45, reg, 45, yeah about 45 regiments and they were copying attrition left, right and centre. Lost the Battle of Montreal, well that was expected to occur, well can you, no why don't you even take me to the location. I can't do anything against their troops, they've just got far more troops than me around here. You drag me into more wars that I can't fight. They bloody are, aren't they? I'll probably have to take control of that one as well. Get marching south. Still losing troops. You've got to be kidding me, they're still losing troops. How can they still be losing troops? Oh, I knew there was buggers over there that were making it worse. Um, no. Make them happy. Don't piss them off. Oh, middle Frank here is also fighting. France in some war. That's good, though, they'll take some of the pressure off. If I can land some of my troops over on their territory. They can have some effect on their... Actually, wait a second, why don't you just send these troop guys around? I want to see what's floating around their territory. Breach load of rifles is nearly complete as well. Finally, yay! They're only fighting Brunei and the Ming. I don't know why they're fighting Brunei and Ming for. We're going to have to occupy all their territory, I guess, if they're not going to give in to terms. Yeah, they'll win that battle. They're copping a bit of a morale hit, but they'll win, that's for sure. Losing money now as well. 
Keep sending them south. I don't actually if they they don't have too many troops. They've attacked them. They've attacked the they've attacked the frigate. Okay, that was expected to be fair. I'm just gonna have to keep marching through and just keep attacking them, I guess. If I can hold on for long enough, I can guess the uh, get them to help me fight the fight the British. I'm going down there to Wilmington. Are they still copying our attrition? No, they're not finally. About bloody time. Um, I just want to go back to military quickly. Build army. Still plenty of Finns want to join the army. Like build them all. No, I'm pissed off some want to join. Bustle look, uh, can't pronounce that. As of finish, okay. More important. Oh, actually, I'm occupying some of their territory over there. That's kind of funny. Don't know how much effect it will actually have, but they are there. How many soldiers have been built over here in Smolensk? A oh, few. Same thing in Karelia. Let's have a look at Karelia then. Um, just keep playing as well. Yeah, they're building up slowly. Oh, Pavo Manaheim has just passed. Ah, oh, how sad. I actually won that battle? Wow, I'm kind of shocked. Because if I could actually land some troops in British soil, I just don't know how many they've got there. That's the thing. Battle of Straits of Dover. Um, bring all these soldiers over here as well. So that's the problem is when you're attacking these sorts of places, they are highly expensive to siege. Yeah, and just keep moving through. Where's their capital? Well, we'll gradually work our way down to the capital. And that should be... and that should do the trick eventually. Gonna lose troops, but I should be able to rebuild a lot of them. On the Battle of Durban, which was expected... I wasn't about 70 regiments at the start of this, and now it's decreased a little bit. Um, I want these guys to go over here to Baku. These chaps. And more importantly, what is the Oz combat with is done? We are king, we are not surprised to learn that has honored our military alliance and joined our invincible in the Mexican liberation of the Finnish Yucatan. So the Empire of Mexico has just declared war on me out of nowhere. I did not expect that. At all, actually. That is not good. You know what? We need to get more of this military stuff done. Because it's not great. How long will that take to unlock? 1867. That'll be like about a year. I did not expect Mexico to declare war at all. Who are they allied with? No one really. So, if I can get... That's decreased by about six regiments as well, isn't it? It's not good. We can position ourselves to such a point that it makes it incredibly difficult for them to attack over in Philadelphia. Maybe we might be able to, just maybe, pull for victory against them. Now keep moving them forward. If these joined in, so is Colombia, so is Bavaria. Expect nothing less. I just want to get a peace deal, actually. If 
Close deal. What do you want? You're gonna have to grind it out for a bit longer, I think. Um, what about these guys? Are they willing to jump out of the wall? Nope. What about the Asherons? I actually don't really want anything from them. I just want them out of the wall. Because then I can call out my reserves. Um, it's going to take a while. Yeah, I was always going to lose that battle. I was never going to win that battle. That's for sure. They keep just pumping troops into that area. We know what. Go send the rest of these troops over here to support. Wow, they've actually fought pretty successfully against my um, troops over there. She killed quite a few, surprisingly. Ooh, I'm actually kind of surprised. Should win that battle. Um, what are these troops out of nowhere? This happens when they keep sending troops through an area where they can't really do anything. Um, combine all forces together to attack this army. Because <coughs> if we defeat these guys, I suspect that might be enough to knock them out of the war. Come on, fight better than that, for fuck's sakes. Oh, apologies about me swearing a bit there, but... I'm trying to get my point across. We really shouldn't be losing those battles. If they lose that, that is utterly disgraceful. And they are going to lose that, this right? Wow, that is really bad. They really have no reason not to win that battle there. I can't believe they've actually lost that. Wow. Send the troops south here. Bring these soldiers over here. I can't believe they've just lost that battle. That is really surprising. I'm expecting them to win that pretty comfortably. Um, send them over here as well. As well as these guys. And those guys as well. Now hopefully, this gets discovered pretty soon. Min life rating. Oh, I've got, got to have invented machine guns at least. Or even naval logistics. White piece. Yep, Asherons are out of the war. Well, that's a good thing. What else do I need again? Naval logistics. Naval logistics. Where is naval logistics? That's over here. Mm, that's going to take a while. What do I just cancel that and start? Mm, no. I'd just be better off waiting for machine guns, I think. Because naval logistics is going to take a while to catch up to. Now, on the other hand, you know what? I'm actually going to cancel that. Um, I'm going to change it to Naval Logistics. Oh, wait a second. It's halfway down anyway, so it doesn't matter. I've got to wait till 8 and 70 regardless. You know what? I might research that instead. Anything to make it go a bit quicker. When will that be done? 1868. But anyway, that'll probably do for the moment. Hope you all enjoyed yourselves. And watching my army absolutely collapse over here, that was um, not what I expected. But as per usual, if you did enjoy yourselves, please like, comment. Wait, where are you guys going? No, you stay there. Stay there. I should stop trying to do stuff when... I'm not actually playing. Um, but if you enjoyed yourselves, please like, comment, and subscribe. And as per always, bye-bye.